And here, what the Bible says, God promised him that you will have a great nation. Even you will be a nation among the nations. Let's see. As everybody knows that Israel, if you go into the map, Israel is a very small country. Even only a few years back, many countries have accepted him as a country, but before nobody know where is Israel. But some countries accept it, but still some countries they are not accepted him as a country. Even my country, Pakistan, still have no relationship with Israel. Even if you read the Quran, if you read the Bible, the most of the, the material has talked about Israel, right? 읽으면서, but I still don't understand why those people are not accepting Israel. 예, why they don't want 있나? to be a friendship with Israel. 예, and that's why I just understand one thing. 예, that my country is under the curse of God. 예, because God promised to Abraham, who will bless you, I will bless. 예, 내가, 어, 것이고, Whoever curse you, I will curse them. 나를, 너를 저주하면 내가 그를 저주한다고. But we can understand that. If we will bless Israel, it means God will automatically bless our lives. Amen? And the finally, when we fulfill our forgotten roles, there are renewed blessings. Here we can see in 10 years in the life of Jacob that is a physical blessing. But when he fulfilled his role, God renewed his blessings and he says, not only you right now, but your descendants that come will be blessed through you. Hallelujah. Sometimes we think only of a precious life. What is going on and what is going to happen? But here what the Bible says, when he fulfilled the world, God says, not only your family, but your family that has been come will bless. Hallelujah. Because God says, I am the God Almighty. And I want you to be fruitful, increasing numbers. Hallelujah. It means before Jacob never heard about these words. Before he only understand God will bless his journey, his precious life. But when God called him to remind him his role, and he wanted to go and fulfill it, God says, okay, now is the time to give you, to renew your blessings. Hallelujah. If we forgot, forgot our goals to fulfill, then our blessings will be renewed by God. 
저희는요 오늘 새롭게 해주십니다. Because God always want to bless our lives. 하나님 우리를 항상 축복을 해주시기 원하십니다. And here we can see that Jacob's life has been changed. 예, 이 사건 이후로 야곱의 인생은 달라집니다. Because here, verse 14, Jacob set up a stone pillar at the place where God had talked with him. And he poured out a drink offering on it. He also poured out on it. Jacob called the place where God has talked with him Bethel. Amen. 14절 15절 읽겠습니다. 시작. 야곱의 하나님이 자기와 말씀하시던 곳에 기둥 곧돌 기둥을 세우고 그 위에 전대거리를 붓고 또그 위에 기름을 붓고 하나님이 자기와 말씀하시던 곳에 이름을 베데리라 불렀더라. Amen. Now let's open the Bible, Mark chapter 16, verse 15 and 16. He said to them, Go into the world and preach the gospel to all creation, wherever whoever believes and is baptized will be saved. But whoever does not believe will be condemned. Amen. 15절, 16절입니다. 시작. 또 이르시되 너희는 온천에 다니며 만민에게 복음을 전파하라. 믿고 세례를 받는 사람은 떨어질 것이요 믿지 않는 사람은 정죄를 받으리라. If we want to be blessed ourselves, we have to go to the world and share the good news of Jesus to save the people. 우리가 복을 받으려면 우리는 because this is the war that we made with God. I will share the gospel with other people. And what is our promise? I will save the sinners. Amen? I will share your good news to the people. It means that every believer has been chosen by God. In the book of John, what the Bible says, we are the chosen people of God and we have to be bear the fruits. You see, if the tree is not bearing any fruit, what the gardener is doing? 네, 네, 여러분 그그 그, 그, 뭐지 가슴머리 열매를 보면 he cut it and put it to fire 열매를 없는 나무는 어떻게 하죠? 잘라가지고 불에 던져 but 봅니다. if the fruit will grow and make more fruits he prune it the fruit and the fruit come more and more he is both very happy 네, 열매를 맺는 가지는 same of Christian life is the same. We should have to be bear more fruits. Even we are very busy, even we are making money, even we are free, even we have nothing to do. But the one thing we always have to remember, we have to bear the fruit for Jesus. 하나님이 우리 우리를 통해서 열매를 맺도록 했다는 것을 알아내보시며 우리가 바꿨든지 그렇지 않든지 우리가 모든 생활 중에서 어, 열매 맺는 어, 그리스도의 생활을 해야 합니다. Let us close our eyes. Let us pray. Father God, we thank you for this wonderful day that you have given us. 하나님 아버지 오늘 주님을 따라 한 날을 And as Father, we remember as we learned about the message that you has reminded the world. Into the life of Jacob. Because he has a plan to renew his blessings upon his life and his family. Father God, you are the same God, and we believe that you also renewed our blessings in our lives. 하나님 우리 그때 그 하나님이 동일한 하나님이 있습니다. 그래서 우리의 삶도 마찬가지로 정결하게 해서 축복받는 우리 모두가 되기를 원합니다. 
Father God, I pray that if we are forget what we promised to you, Father God, to remind us that we can fulfill as soon as possible. To renew our Hindu blessings. That we can give glory to your name, Jesus. Amen. Father God, we pray that you are the God of grace. You are the God who always wants us to be blessed. We thank you for everything in Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. Amen.